Hey you guys, what's going on awesome folks, this is awesome here, bringing you a Pokemon X and Y Wi-Fi battle, you know, even though they're so mainstream, I don't know, you guys seem to like it, so whatever, I guess I'll just bring some more Wi-Fi battles your way, if that's what you guys enjoy. No, I'm only joking. Hi guys, this is Awesome here. Uh, I know Shade Scarf is a bit weird, but uh, just before this battle started, uh, my opponent and um, some other friends on Twitter were sort of... For some reason, they called me a hipster, even though I'm totally not a hipster, but yeah. <laughs> I, uh, they said, yeah, in before he starts wearing shades and scarves and stuff during his videos. So, I had a scarf, I had some shades, I thought, why not for the lols? So I'm just gonna do this battle in a scarf and some shades. Uh, today! Our opponent is Mr. Powers, as you can see. And that's his real name, by the way. I mean, his, his first name's not Mr., you know, <laughs> but uh, his surname is Powers. So, Mr. Powers. Uh, he's a cool guy. Uh, you might have seen him as a few other PokerTubers opponents. Uh, he's also quite prominent on the Twitter. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a PU match, guys. Um, now, I know that there is some sort of ambiguity about the current state of PU, or BU, whatever the fudge you want to call it. Um, but yeah. Basically, we all know, we all know in our hearts what PU is. So, uh, the way I see it, if you still want to have PU matches, have PU matches, you know, just enforce the rules that you know to be valid and the Pokemon you know to be valid in PU. And that's what we're going to do, because PU is freaking awesome. You could call me a bit of a uh, purist. <laughs> God. Right, anyway, guys, let's hit the battle start button. We've kept the poor guy waiting for long enough. Let's do this. Let's do this. Should really have gone through the team that I'm bringing with you guys first, to be honest. Uh, we're bringing Home Depot the Rotom Frigima Bob, the Frigi Rotom, the Ice Rotom, the only Rotom in PU. Um, bringing Rouge the Bat, the Swoo Bat. We are bringing Groucho the Probo Pass. No, the other pass. The uh, not Probo Pass. Nose Pass! The, yeah, the big conk, just like mine. Uh, we're bringing uh, ba -ba -ba, Shift Tree, uh, Solrock, and Belias. The uh, Ordino. Ordino, that's the one. Mr. Powers is bringing a pretty scary looking team. Pretty scary source looking team. He's, uh, he's, got, his, he's got a Clefairy. Clefairy's a, a scary ass. Oh, Glaceon. Not bad. Not bad at all. We've got our Kuno. That thing's probably going to cause some serious problems. Snova's an unusual choice, but that's Shellgon. That Shellgon is the one that threatens me the most. It certainly is. I think his lead... His lead's going to be Clefairy. I don't have any po... Why? Why do I not have any poison types or steel type moves? That's just stupid as hell. That is stupid as hell. Alright then, let me tell you what I'm going to do. Let me tell you what I'm going to do. We are going to start off... With... You know what, screw it, Home Depot is coming through first. I know that's a risky move, I know that is a risky move, but he's got lots and lots of ice power on his team. He has three ice types, guys. Three! And I did not bring even un fire type. I didn't bring any fairy types. I didn't bring any steel types. I didn't bring any poison types. I'm so close to bringing that Arbok, man. I really wish I had now. Alright, so, first live battle since we brought the channel back. I am hyped. Uh, can I just say it's all of the new subs because we gained yesterday about 51 subs. Dude. Dude. <laughs> thank you all. Thank you all so much. Like, seriously, it really, really means a lot to me. Anyway, time to focus on the battle at hand. Um, oh, this thing's got magic guard, probably. So I'm going to T-wave it just to disrupt it. It's probably going to set up rocks. Uh, but I want to T-Wave it to try and disrupt his strategy somewhat, maybe get a few extra hits off on this bulky-ass beast. <laughs> because it may well be Cosmic Power. Cosmic Power Clefairy in PU could be a bitch to hit to deal with, to be quite honest with you. Uh, let's Volt Switch out. He's going to switch now, most likely, I imagine. No? You're going to stay in, bro? Okay, okay. Okay. I respect that. I can get on board with that. Uh, la, da, 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 da. Let's set up our own rocks because, as I said, he has ice types, he's got a flying type. We need to get some rocks up. That would be tasty right now. Calm mind! Calm. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. 
It's fine. It's fine. Son of a... I'm gonna set up Stealth Rocks, so then we're gonna Volt Switch out. Hope that he doesn't get an attack off on us. Oh, he withdraws! Nice! Okay, okay, good. Good. I don't know what threatened him out. I don't know what forced him to withdraw. Maybe it was the presence of this thing. I'm not really sure what he thought this thing could do to him. Maybe he thinks that this is part steel type, uh, just like Brub Pass. But it's not. This guy is pure rock. Big old Rocky Cocknose. <laughs> do you know That's what I should have called him. Rocky Cocknose. Would that even fit? I don't know. What's the character limit in X and Y? I know it's quite large. Giggity. <laughs> but I don't know what it is. Uh, we're probably not faster than Snowba, to be perfectly honest. So... Bridge the bat? No, because the ice type moves, though. The ice type moves. Yeah, our team doesn't have a lot to deal with this guy, to be perfectly honest. Um... Do you know what? I'm going to send Home Depot back in. I'm going to paralyze him. Uh, or burn him if he's physical. And then I'm going to Volt Switch out. I think. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> Woodhammer! So he's physical. Okay. Luckily, this thing is physically defensive, so we should take that quite well. I know a physically defensive Rotom Cross is probably not the best set, but I wanted to try it, so I tried it. And uh, I think it's done quite well, to be honest, in a lot of instances. Um, Willow. Willow. Willow! Just- oh, come on! Are you serious? Avalanche? Yeah, that's- that's resisted, buddy. That's- that's not going to do nothing. That ain't going to do a thing. Uh, so now that he sees the Willow, he's probably going to switch out. You're going to bring Clefairy back in, just to try and screw with me? I'm going to Willow anyway, just in case you don't. I have a feeling you might possibly stay in. No, you won't! Why would you stay in? Why would- oh, you did stay in? Okay, never mind. I thought you wouldn't stay in because you saw that your two stabs aren't doing that much to us. Okay, Leech Seed, but yeah, there's no chance in hell that I'm going to stay in, man. No sorry, Bob. This is just a crippling mission. Rotom Frost comes in there, he shoots a few sniping bullets into your legs, because he doesn't want you dead. He doesn't want you dead. He snipes your knees, cripples you, you have to crawl along on the ground, and things, and stuff. What am I even talking about? Okay, time to Volt Switch. Time for Plan B! Okay, the withdrawal, good. Who are you bringing in then? The fairy! No! It's okay, it's okay. We'll switch in shift tree, outspeed, get a nice and tasty seed bomb off, and that should pick up the KO. Even if this thing's physically invested, that should pick up the KO. In my opinion! Uh, yeah, so shift tree. Let's do this, buddy. I believe in your shift tree. I believe in something, something mystery. Oh yeah, I'm spitting out those bars. Might as well call me the man of flame. <laughs> oh, the many lame bars. In case you were wondering, guys, sorry, I just started singing and got completely lost on the tangent. Um, I went for the fake out there because um, I figured this thing may possibly, I don't know, I don't know, somehow live a seed bomb or some BS like that. So I thought, may as well get some free damage off just to ensure 100% this thing goes down. He's probably... He might try and save this thing. He might try and save... I mean, I don't think he will, but there's a possibility. Uh, so I was debating going for knockoff to try and get the item off of whatever wants to switch in. But, uh, looks like he didn't. So that's good. Awesome source. Okay, what's coming in now? We should be outspeed most of his team, I'm sure. If he, He'll send in Articuno, though. He'll send in Articuno, surely. That's going to be a thing. But you know who can take on Articuno quite well? My boy, nose pass. Now that thing is not offensive at all. Uh, but a couple of ancient powers. I mean, I know, I know, you know, especially bulky. But I think a couple of ancient powers will do it. You know, maybe three, maybe three, maybe. No, I'll we'll have to stealth rocks damage too. Oh, this guy. Say goodbye to your reviolite. Um. Yeah, say goodbye to your reviolite. And then, or. Oh! All the damage and it was sashed? You gonna dragon dance me, bro? You gonna dragon dance me? Oh, you son of a biscuit. You son of a biscuit. This dragon dance shell gun could actually cause some problems. Um, yeah, another knockoff will take this thing down. And that's smashing news. But, if he out... Well, he is gonna outspeed, but if he goes for an attack, then we're in some serious schnizzle right now. Why no fairy types? Fire Fang! Oh, goddamn. Good game. <laughs> Good game, Lock. Thank you, Shiftry. You did great, buddy. 
Much appreciated. Uh, Ru oh, Rouge won't. Rouge won't outspeed this thing. It's fast, but... I mean, Groucho will take the hits, though. Groucho will take the hits. See, Felix, Felix, you've got Dazzling Gleam, haven't you? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. But at the same time... Oh, Fire Fang, Fire Fang, Fire Fang. You don't mind Fire Fang. You're bulky as hell. You could really help against... Uh, yeah, I need you at full health. Felix, come on in, buddy. I'm feeling the it's. I'm feeling feel it's right now. I think he can do this. Or to know about that. <laughs> no, D-Gleam coming through. Let's do this. And then, uh, depending on our health situation... Alright, okay, fair enough. Fair enough. You probably think that this is a fairy type, don't you? But it's not. It's not a fairy type. I wonder what item you've got. I wonder if it will be beneficial to us. I might just take it. <laughs> With, um, oh no, wait, I don't have. I've got a skill swap, not switcheroo. I'm thinking of my showdown session, guys. Even though I don't have this thing on my showdown session. But you know what I mean. The strategies and the mix ups in the brain. Cut a guy some slack, okay? Okay? <laughs> um, Alright, see, now the way I see it is. Oh, does anything need a wish? Nothing really. I mean, Home Depot could do with a wish, I guess, but now it's not the time for that. Now it's not the time for that. Uh, yeah, we may as well just D-Gleam and take this thing down, I guess. Yeah, D-Gleam, take it down. Not bad. Okay. Snowbird is nice, though. Oh, what? <laughs> Why did I not pay attention to the damage from before? I am such a fool. Such a fool. Fool, fool. The thing is, though, I'm just going to switch out now into something that can take that wood hammer really well, take his ice-type moves really well, um, yeah, to be honest, Rotten Frost. Rotten Frost is something that I could really do with having in right now. And then that will negate the fact that you have Leech Seed on us, and that's all good. Saying that, Rouge the Bat, he's probably going to go for an Avalanche, predicting us to outspeed and get a hit off. That's what I think. So, yeah, Rotten Frost. Come on out! I really like Rotten Frost, actually. Uh, the only person I've seen be a strong proponent of Rotten Frost is Crook, the Master Crook. If you guys don't know who that is, he's a cool guy, man. Check him out on Twitter, The Master Crew. Uh, he's, he's done, he started making YouTube videos and stuff lately, you know, some Let's Plays and stuff. Fun, fun times. And uh, he likes to stab like it. Not literally, but he, he likes to talk about it a lot. So if you're cool with that, you're cool with him. Um, gonna parry this thing, then Volt Switch out, and then wreck its life. Hopefully. Hopefully that's how this is gonna go. You gonna defog me, bruh? You gonna defog me? Is that how this is gonna go? Here I am! Rock you like a hurricane! <laughs> oh man, I'm so glad that hurricane missed. That would have done some damage. So lefties won. Alright, not bad. Not bad. Might have to skill swap you. Maybe we can bolt switch into Alcuna and skill swap you. But to be honest, I don't want to do that. I just want to straight up take you out. I don't want to faff around with any shenanigans when I can just take you down. <laughs> oh, nice damage. Nice damage. Even after the lefties. Uh, you're not going to have enough health left to take an ancient power, I don't think. I don't think. Yeah, Groucho's going to come in. Groucho's going to come in, get that ancient power off. Stealth Fox was so useful there, man. Articuno was a bulky-ass beast. Yeah, the hail, that's fine. That's fine. I can look... Ah, oh, has this thing got Blizzard? Is this like a hail-blizzard combo team? That's why... That's why... Do you know what? Sometimes, even though it's obvious, I don't think about things, and um, I just sort of forget to come to obvious conclusions. Like, I've just realized all those ice types, including uh, <laughs> a hail setter, and of course, it's the boost up his ice type team, and so, so stupid sometimes. Ancient power! Let's do this, guys. Let's do this. He stayed in? Fair enough, dude. Fair enough. I wouldn't have, personally. Unless you don't have a heal bell user or a wish bash on your team. I mean, if you've got someone with heal bell, the Sato Kuno still could have done work. I mean, if you can if you can defog and or heal bell, well actually no, it'd have to be defog and heal bell, but now I'll do some work with it. Um, yeah, if not, then I suppose, yeah, let me, let me get KO'd was probably the best option. In my honest opinion. Right, so this thing, eh, your scary source, but how scary source? I think I just want to get some momentum, I don't think I want to hard switch. I could T-wave it though. T-wave then, yeah, I'm going to T-wave you, then I'm going to boss switch. I'm a T wave, you then have a whole switch. I think that sounds like a fucking bad idea! Subcar mine, subcar mine, Glaceon. Sub fucking mine, 
But Ice Body! Ice Body 2 though. Fuck. This thing's special defense is good. This thing's special defense is good. Uh, so you've got sub. You might not have wish though if you're relying on Ice Body. Do you know what? Let's go for Ancient Power. Let's break this up. Let's see if it brings you sub. Aqua Tail? Physical. Physical Glacier. I am surprised. I. I am much surprised right now. <laughs> Can this break it? Okay. Oh, yeah! Not invested, though. I'm taking it you are not invested uh, in the old uh, special defenses. Because uh, this guy is not offensive at all, so you really should have been able to take that quite well. I think. Then again, it is stab. Yeah. Right, so. <laughs> Uh, this thing, this thing, this scary ass thing. Aquatail. You wanna go for Aquatail Zombie, bruh? You wanna go for Aquatail Zombie? Do you know what? He's probably gonna try and sub up again, so I'm just gonna Ancient Power again, break the sub. No, Ice Fang! Alright, maybe you predicted some kind of switch. But we'll take that quite well. And the Ancient Power, let's see how much damage it actually does. Because before we ascertained that it did. Okay, it did about 30%, maybe 35. Alright, nice. It's actually surprising. Okay, I'm just going to stay in because we've got the rocks up with this guy. Uh, we did some serious damage to the thing. And, um, yeah, and now anything extra that he does is ancillary. You know, it, it, it's just an extra bonus. It's nice. Uh, but, you know, he's done his work. You know, Groucho has come through. So, yeah, now anything he can do is just bonus. Um, right, so we might not actually be able to take this thing down. No, yeah, no, we will. This next ancient power will take him down. Um, and we've still got someone else to spread thunder waves if we need them. All right, we can take this. We can take this ice bank, right? 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 Yeah, of course we can. Nice and tasty. Thank you so much. That was a really bad Mario impression. <laughs> My lord. God damn. Uh, yeah, for those of you that didn't watch the intro or, or are new to the channel, I don't always wear douchey glasses and a scarf when I'm battling. It's just. It's a hipster reference because of the conversation I was having on Twitter. It's just for lols, guys. It's just for lols. Um, yeah, okay, so I think that I am going to Thunder Wave because uh, I want to get a free switch. I don't want to switch out. I don't want a hard switch. Uh, but on the off chance, if you'd like to set up on me or something, I want to get a T-Wave up on it. I mean, he's slow already, but it just helps, you know? It just helps with stuff and things, all right? Helps with stuff and things. Really wish I still had Shift Free around, actually. Eep. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. I said it's cool, guys. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set Velias in. And I am going to do the switching. I'm going to switch and stuff. I am going to skill swap you. That's how this is going to go, brother. Charge beam. <laughs> I don't know why I made that noise. That did okay damage, actually. And he gets the uh, spat. Spatat. Spatat. It's Spatat phrase. Okay, so now you won't be able to use your item. I get you thick fat. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, so now I should also be able to use my lefties! Ha ha ha! Recovery! Yes! I love this. I love Ordino. Ordino is beautiful. Uh, I'm gonna go for a yawn. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a yawn. I'm gonna go for a yawn. Don't send in the one that's parried. Don't do it. Don't oh, son of a bitch! <laughs> the bird will take you down though, right? No, Stealth Rocks will take you down. Oh, you just wanted a free switch, that's okay. And you now get to scout out the fact that I have Yawn. But, you've got nothing to soak up a Yawn now. So something is going to sleep, buddy. Something is going to sleep. And when you're sleeping, I'm gonna do bad things. <laughs> what? Okay. Um, okay, some more, more Stealth Rocks damage for you. Yeah, uh, and of course you've got your ability back as well, so you can use your life orb, but that's fine, because I am going to yawn your face. going to yawn right in your face. Power gem, yeah, okay, that's not stab. You should have gone for a side shot, man. Uh, yeah, because that's going to do nothing to yawn you, so you either have to switch or sleep. So let us see now. The thing is, if we switch out, then we we get clutch again. But that's, that's not the end of the world. That's definitely not the end of the world. Um... Gonna get a wish up. I'm gonna get a wish up. And then I'm gonna switch into. Maybe Rouge? 
Get a wish up, switch into Rouge, take a hit. No, because this guy, this guy just used a rock type move, so I think Soul Rock's the best move. I don't think this guy is going to have any dark type moves. Um, do you know what? I'm not even going to bother with the wish, because Soul Rock's got his own recovery. Let's just switch into Helios! Helios, do Magistus. I love Yu-Gi-Oh! So part of me is really tempted to bring Yu-Gi-Oh! duels to the channel. <laughs> But I'm doing so much, I'm going to be starting Borderlands 2 with Ryan Twerkle and uh, Don Fanatic soon. I'm doing my Skyrim LP, which is going to be starting up really soon. It was supposed to start on Monday, but I had issues and things. Um, and yeah, yeah, obviously I've got Pokemon, I'm going to have Smash Bros soon. I've got a few projects lined up uh, that aren't necessarily to do with gaming uh, or battles or anything crazy like that. You know, I've got some, got some cool things, got some cool things man, if I do say so myself. Um, yeah, so just gonna cosmic power, I think. Here I am, rock you like a hurricane. I love that song so much, and every time somebody uses hurricane, that's what gets stuck in my head. Without a doubt, indubitably. Alrighty. Okay, we've got our defenses up a bit higher now. Let's just go for rock slides. Screw it. See how much this does. Probably not much, to be honest. <laughs> Actually, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad at all. That probably would have been a two-hit KO from full, I think. Yeah. Easy. Easy. All right, so Grumpy goes down. Not bad. Here I am. Seriously, people sleep on the Cosmic Power Recycled Citrus Berry Soul Rock. The thing is nice. Man. It is nice. Oh, this guy. I am sorry, Shelgon. Sorry, Bagon. <laughs> but you're about to go down to a Zen and Bird. Okay. We've got our defenses up. The only chance you have of taking this out is uh, Dragon Dancing, at least once, and trying to power through the team. Unfortunately, that's not going to happen. So that's, that's good game. That is good game, Mr. Powers. Thank you so much for this battle. This was ridiculously fun. I haven't PU'd in a while. That sounds really gross and rude. <laughs> but yeah, I haven't had a PU tier battle in a while, mainly because PU is in some kind of crazy limbo right now. Uh, but, you know, hopefully one day I'll be back to its former glory. I'm going to save this battle video just in case this uh, this recording faffs up somehow and I have to make it a postcom. But yeah, let me, let me know, guys. What did you think of this battle? I really enjoyed it. Mr. Powers was a good opponent. Uh, he had a really nice team. I know he breeds all this stuff himself as well. Uh, himself, sorry. Uh, so yeah, no, no pokey banking right there. No, um... The thing, the Jen, Jenny, 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 Pokey Jenny. Wait, no, that sounds like a YouTuber. Never mind. Anyway, shut up. I'm rambling. Thanks for coming by, guys. If you enjoyed this battle, leave a like down below if you want, if you fancy it. I mean, you know, you don't have to, no pressure. But what I do like is if you leave me a comment down below, let me know what you thought of the battle, if you liked it, if you didn't. Did you like the video? Did you like my style of presenting and battling? Is there anything you would have done differently? Tell me what you didn't like. Tell me what you did like. Just inform me. Feed my knowledge. We shall grow together my friends. Anyway, thanks for coming by guys. I love you all. Have a sis awesome day. I'll see you later.